Greetings, comrades, and welcome to this episode of Weird Russian News. And I know what you're thinking. I can read your mind. It's screaming right now. No more Corona. No more Corona. We don't want coronavirus news. And rejoice. There are only two of them in this episode. But before we begin, let me remind you to leave a like and subscribe to my channel if you want to see more weird Russian news. Now, let's go. Russian released from prison, robbed his mistress and bought a gift for his beautiful wife. Indeed, a wise choice. Now that's actually a wonderful move, which once again proves that the Russians are extremely smart. By Russian laws, a wife can visit him in prison, but a lover cannot. Therefore, robbing his wife and giving a gift to his mistress would be a very, very bad strategy. Kuzba's man ate fly agric to cleanse his mind and body and hit a policeman. Well, in Russia we have one big fan of mushrooms. Maybe it was him? <laughs> it's funny that three guys ate the mushrooms, but only one of them actually hit a policeman. Others two were perfect gentlemen. This headline though, it sounds like a to-do list for somebody. It's like, hmm, it's Saturday. Okay, first, cleanse the body. Then, cleanse the soul. And next, hmm, oh. A perfect day. Kostroma residents sniffed feces for six years due to their inability to use sewers. Alright, maybe it was their fetish? No king shaming on this channel, you know. Just a dirty little weakness. And if it's not, then we can always ask our Indian friends to help us. I heard they're familiar with some shitty problems. And they found the magical solution for all of them. Let's take the poo to the moon. Let's take the poo to the moon. Ah, music. It truly comes from God. But enough with the fun stuff, let's move on to our lovely coronavirus. The time has come. Oh no! Kaliningrad's authorities decided to remove all the benches from the streets so that the residents would not violate quarantine. Galaxy brain in every article. But they were not the first. Rostov mayor had the same bright thoughts earlier. What the kind of isolation? And I guess some Russian cities decided to go deeper and remove all roads from the streets. It was also said that good weather provokes people. I guess we finally found out why the weather in Russia is always like this. Or like this. No exceptions. Residents of Penza drink, fight with excess and run away through balconies in quarantined buildings. Yeah, and what do you want? Quarantine is boring. Boring! As for X fighting, I loved it when I was a kid. So maybe they just were nostalgic too. Also, two women jumped from the balcony and tried to go for a walk. Remember that woman who fell into a snowdrift from the ninth floor and then went to walk? Now she has followers. I officially propose to declare jumping from the balconies an Olympic sport. Ah, I forgot, they won't allow Russia. 